So Ross, first of all, a huge warm welcome. Tell us why you've come to Chelsea. I came to Chelsea, you know, I'm ambitious and I'm, I'm wanting to further my career by winning things and playing with the best and obviously it was a big decision of mine, you know, to leave my boyhood club but, you know, I, I felt this was the right right decision of mine to come to a massive club like Chelsea and, and improve myself and, and challenge for trophies. Like you said, you have moved from the club where you've been at since I think the age of 11, so it is, I guess, a big thing for you and for the family too. Yeah, it is. Um, it's a big decision, you know, I've had to think about it properly and, um, you know, I felt like this is the right thing for me, you know, to to improve as a player and challenge myself, you know, to come out of my comfort zone and come down to London and play for a massive club like Chelsea and try and achieve great things. And how important is the right timing when it comes to a move like this as well? I feel like this is the right time for me, you know, to to kick on now at a massive club like Chelsea. Um, I'm 24, I've played a lot of games in the Premier League and I feel like I'm ready now. Tell us about the prospect of working with the boss, Antonio Conte. What excites you about that? You can see from the outside how passionate he is as a manager and, and he's up there with the best in the world, you know. And um, to get the chance to play under him, it's um, an unbelievable chance for me. And, and he's a winner and to be surrounded by winners as, as the players are here as well, you know, it's only going to bode well for me. What do you like about the teams that he manages? Full of energy, very en entertaining, you know, and create loads of chances, solid defensively and, and he achieves great things by winning trophies as he did last season with the Premier League. And of course I guess there's a couple of familiar faces for you when you walk into the dressing room for the first time. Yeah there is, there's Gaz and, um, and uh, Danny and I'm, I'm familiar with them you know through, through playing for England but I, I don't really know any of the other lads but I'm looking forward to getting to know them. Tell us about your position, I mean obviously we've watched you with a keen eye playing for Everton, where do you see yourself at your best? I can play anywhere across midfield or, you know, in the number 10. I can play further up, you know, inside forward positions. Um, but anywhere I'm needed, you know, I'll, I'll do all I can, you know, to help the team win. And that's the main thing. And looking at the formations that Chelsea have played of late, it's 3-4-3, three, three, it's, it's 3-5-2. Do you see yourself fitting in nicely with that? Yeah, perfect for me. Um, I've done that over the years, you know, at club level for Everton. And I feel like I can do that here and, and keep improving and showing what I can do. Tell us about your condition, how's the fitness, how are you feeling at the moment? Yeah, I'm feeling great now, uh, you know, I had a, a difficult time, um, I was out for six months, you know, with my hamstring injury, but now, now I've been training for two weeks, I'm feeling great and I'm looking forward to, you know, to kicking on and, and getting playing as soon, as soon as possible. And of course you've come back from injuries before, haven't you? What does that say about your, your strength of, of character and your attitude? I always respond well, you know, to injury, I know, I know how to... Um, to deal with them, you know, because I broke my leg as a young lad. Um, I've had big in injuries, and I always come back better, better from them. So, you know, I'm not making any excuses. I'm looking forward to getting started and and um, improving as a player. We've obviously had some big players here at Chelsea, some goal-scoring midfielders as well. Tell us about growing up and, and watching players that you've idolised as a boy. Yeah, I grew up idolising Frank Lampard, and and I idolised uh, Michael Ballack, you know, when I was growing up and. He was a player here as well, but um, with Frank, yeah, I idolised him a lot and I was lucky enough to play with him, you know, for England. And um, to watch him in England sessions, you know, the hunger that he had, you know, to score goals and I've got that and hopefully if, if I do half as good as what Frank did here, then I'll be a success. Of course, he wore the number eight during his time here. It's a number you've worn before. Tell us what it means to you and the importance of that. The number eight shirt means a lot to me, you know, I was number eight at Everton and um, to get the number eight shirt here means a lot. I know like previous players that I've wore it here, you know, like Lamp Lampard wore it. But yeah, I've got to um, work hard and hopefully work hard, you know, for the fans in the club and I'll do all I can, you know, to bring more success to the club. You've just turned 24, you've played a lot of games in the top flight, but just how much better do you think you can become as a player? I've got a lot of room for improvement. I'm, um, I'm fo focused, you know, day to day. I'll give 100%, and I'm um, focused on improving um, every day. Um, I'll give all I can. Yeah. What excites you most about coming here and I guess playing in the Champions League? I mean, we're fighting on, on four fronts at the moment, aren't we? Yeah, we are. We've got um, we've got a tough game against Barcelona, but as you've seen in the past, Chelsea Football Club can beat Barcelona. We've done that. I'm looking forward to it. It's been a dream of mine to play in the Champions League, so. I'm looking forward to getting started. And as a player, do you set yourself targets year on year? Yeah, I do set myself targets, you know. I've got to improve every year. 
as every player tries to do when I'm, I set myself targets with scoring goals and assists. And you sound, signed a long-term contract here at Chelsea. What are your aims and your aspirations for that time? My aims are to win trophies. Well, if you play football, you've got to be a winner, and I'm focused on being a winner at Chelsea Football Club and continuing what this club creates. And finally, with that in mind, then, what message would you give to Chelsea supporters watching this right now? I'm looking forward to the journey ahead and creating more history with the club.